at our service, and uh, you know, they, these guys leave here, um, except for Jen. <laughs> Can't get rid of her, but uh, that's a good thing. <laughs> and uh, you know, they, they continue on with the ministry and continue on. Some of them are continuing on with Reach Global, uh, others go back to jobs and, and different things. So uh, we just want to ask God's blessing on them, and I'm going to ask God. Uh, can you say something? Sure, you can say something. <laughs> I didn't do this in the first service, but Emma and I had a chance to go to our Eastern District Conference back in October. Reach Global was there, and we ran into a kid named Ryan, who's a graduate college. Uh, he'd been down here on a number of trips, uh, helping with the response. And because of our hospitality, you can share us what you've done, uh, with all those groups that came, uh, he felt God's call in his life to, to go on full-time staff with Reach Global. And he specifically said that it was because of his experience here at Church. Amen. Amen. Well, you guys come, come, come around and say I can be behind them or wherever and lay your hands on them and you can lead us in prayer. Well, one thing that uh, Kevin was talking about, and I had several chances to talk to him, he said 800 people came through. One of the things the team did wasn't just minister to Brian King and Mr. Giles, they ministered to those 800 people who came through. And those people, when they left, they, they saw the love of Christ people and so they took them back all over the country and I still remember that one guy from Montana and so they were he was here many times and but again that's all the price that these uh, individuals demonstrated that went all over the country so it does right. Then Father Lord we thank you for who you are Lord you are God. Your ways are higher than our ways. We don't understand when tragedy hits, Lord. But, Lord, we saw a glimpse of who you are, Lord, for bringing this team here to, to begin. We thank you for the opportunity to be able to uh, open up our doors, Lord, and have an opportunity to serve them as they serve those in, in just a uh, terrible time. As Kevin mentioned, we thank you for those who came to know Christ through this ministry, Lord. Lord, I pray you today that they will be growing in Christ, Lord. We thank you for bringing the Bible, Lord, and Lord, again today as they just worship you, we pray that their uh, worship would be sweet to you, Lord. I thank you for this team as they uh, move forward in their life, Lord, Lord. I pray that we just meet their needs that they have, because again, as they are missionaries, Lord, they are waiting on you, Lord, and you have been uh, able to provide for them, Lord. Lord, we just thank you for just uh, the people that they touched. Um, not only those the team that came, but the 120 homes, Lord, Lord, that, again, that uh, they heard the gospel, they saw the gospel lived out by these individuals, Lord, that through that, somewhere in their life, Lord, that they will come to know you as personal Savior. So, Lord, we just thank you, we praise you, we give you all the honor and glory in your name.